Hey everybody, welcome back to Raw Food Muscle and today I'm going to be showing you another protein shake and this is uh, great for right after your workout. I just finished my workout so now I'm going to be pumping them some more vitamins and minerals back into my, my body so I'm going to be making a coconut kale with some extra protein powder and this is a um, uh, protein raw protein organic sprouted powder and uh, this is really good I highly recommend this because the taste is not as um, uh, you know not as bitter some of those some some there's some protein powders that have a like a chalky taste I don't want to get into names or anything but um, I think this one was pretty good so um, I'm recommending it if you're looking for it go to my Amazon store and check it out I have it listed over there okay so I'm also using a young coconut really good source of electrolytes and um, I don't have this in organic you know unfortunately but uh, I do what, what I can with what I got everything costs money around here and it's like ridiculous how much these coconuts can cost I mean this isn't organic it's a dollar fifty you go to you know Santo Domingo or something like that they're like well they're all over the place going for free so anyway let me show you what I do to open this up. I mean there's a lot of different techniques to open this up. You can shave down uh, the skin and then crack it open but you know I just do it my way and a lot of people do it this way also and basically what I do is I use a heavy knife that has some weight to it and I just kind of whack it a few times and then just crack it open. And this can be messy. Sometimes it's messy sometimes it's not and that liquid is right up on the top there so I'm going to really have to be careful here so y'all going to have to excuse me alright now when I get the meat uh, I basically just use a spoon I don't you know use anything too fancy and, and, but if you do use a spoon I recommend using a bigger spoon because it scoops it right out see that all that meat's in there that's nice and see this is what I love about coconuts oh my goodness that meat right there that is all yummy flavor right there I mean you can't hmm. oh man they're so they're so fresh you can't get that from an older coconut I mean with the old, older coconuts, you know, you get all those little pieces of, uh, I guess you call it grit, and um, you know, it's, it's you know, it's almost like a carrot where you're sitting there and you're eating it and you're eating it and you're chewing on it and chewing on it, and uh, and it's not it's not the same as this nice smooth soft meat. I mean, it's just so good. So if you can get this in your area. I highly recommend getting this one because this is so yummy. All right, so I got that in there. Put that aside. And I'm gonna get my kale. <clears throat> and sometimes it's a hit or miss with the coconuts. I hate to say it, in terms of how much meat you get, um, I get a little upset when uh, you know if I don't get a whole lot of meat and water on there, but you know what can you do you know it's just one of those things I'm just going to add a little bit more water in here because sometimes I'll say the average coconut probably has about I don't know a cup and a half of water something like that um, so I usually I just add a little bit more water so now I'm just going to add some extra protein powder I'm just going to add a scoop a heaping scoop and let's see a little bit more water and now I just want to add some honey for some sweetness now the honey uh, that I get I, I try to get it local as much as I can and I actually spoke to a couple of beekeepers in this area and they were telling me uh, mm, that's good they were telling me how they how they make the honey and uh, they were actually showing me how it's all done and I'm actually thinking about taking a class of the honeybees anyway alright here we go 
Let's get this thing rocking. Alright, so I think that's good. Now I'm just going to pour this in this little cup over here. Or mug, I should say. I used to have a whole bunch of glass cups, but when you got four kids running around the house, after a while you get tired of seeing things get broke, so it's Plastic City in our house, unfortunately. So anyway, uh, check out the color. That is this richness right there. Alright, salute. Mm. Oh man, you gotta try this. Great for after the workout. You know, once you get your your blood pumping in your system after a nice, strong, hard workout, get yourself one of these to replenish you back up again. Because if you don't, you're going to feel fatigued, you're going to feel tired. You don't want that. So you want to put those vitamins and minerals back in your body to feel strong so you're ready to go again. Okay? Hope you guys enjoy this. I'll see you next time on Raw Food and Muscle.